Hey! Yo, music friends! What's up? Well, this is our first stream on the new channel. And as you probably can hear by the music, we're gonna continue the Undertale playthrough and Candyman is here. Hey, Candyman. Expert Archer, Corey, Olonbori, M. Oko. Hey, everybody. Uh, yo, Fabrice Funke. Hey, man, how are you doing? Uh, I'm looking forward to this stream. I think this stream will be a little bit more chill because there, there'll be less people for sure because this channel is much smaller. But yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Alastor says, oh my god, I'm here. Hello, everyone. Hello, Alastor. Okay, so yeah, I think it will be less people than, than, than last stream, but I don't think it will be... I think it will still be a considerable number of people, which is cool. Alright, so... Kamal says, looking forward to this. Cool, I'm looking forward to it too. Last time, we fell in a hole full of monsters. We got deceived by a flower. Uh, we met our goat mom. We did a bunch of puzzles in the ruins, and I think we're about almost done with the ruins, I, th I think. Uh, and also, oh, by the way, fridge, fridge update, because I'm seeing here a lot of people seeing, saying that they watched the, the VOD of the last stream. On the last stream, I talked about my fridge. Do you guys need a fridge update? My fridge is back. So my life is back to normal now. I have a fridge again. My fridge got fixed. Abigail's you oh Abigail, let me make you a mod. You will be a mod. I I I have no mods in, in this channel at all because this channel is new. So Abigail is now a mod. Congrats, Abigail. In the name of the video game gods. I bestow upon you the powers to ban annoying people. Amen. And, and, and Natalia asks, did you carry the fridge back? Yes. So now that's twice in my life I had to carry a fridge through three, three floors of stairs. So yeah, shall we begin? Oh yeah. Alastor says, chat, don't spoil. Last time, uh, people spoiled. I mean, I didn't get spoiled, but but people were, you know, backseating and just being annoying. But I think this time will be better, because there will be less people. But just in case, I'm gonna pin a comment here saying... No... Boy... Spoilers. And uh, and Fast Freddy asks, what what broke your fridge in the first place? I don't know. It just start it stopped uh, working. And we called a guy, and the guy came to my house, and he said uh, he tried to fix it, and he said he couldn't fix it, so he had to take it back to his fridge repair shop. And I spent eight days without a fridge. Eight days without a fridge. That's you don't realize how dependent we are on these kind of things. Uh, me and, and Julia, we had to eat, you know, stuff that doesn't spoil, stuff stuff that doesn't go bad. Or if you if we wanted to eat something that does spoil, we had to eat, you know, small quantities that we could finish like in a day because we we can we couldn't store food. So I, I felt like a caveman. It was a, an interesting experience. But yeah, let's begin. 
let's begin. Enough talk about fridges. That's not why why we're here. And Abigail says, yeah, David, you're wearing a different color. It's the first time ever in my YouTube career that I'm not wearing a white shirt. So we're making history here. But yeah, let's uh, let's begin. Yes, let's begin. So we watched this already. Uh, continue. Man, we, we played for over an hour already. Okay. Man, this song has been stuck in my head for the whole week. I was trying to compose this week for a game and... and... So good. <laughs> Composing a track with another track stuck inside your head is horrible. It's like trying to listen to two songs at the same time. Do you smell that? Where are we? Oh, there's a guitar. Surprise! It is a butterscotch cinnamon pie. Oh, so that's why she asked me if I liked uh, butterscotch or cinnamon. And Christoph Jacobs is here. Hey, Christoph, how are you doing, man? Uh, I thought we might celebrate your arrival. Uh, okay. I want you to have a nice time living here. I don't want to live here. So, I will hold off on snail pie for tonight. Okay. Here, I have another surprise for you. Dovi, yes. Mon says, hi Dovi. Yeah, that's our name. These books are worn. They must have been read many times. I suppose I should follow her. Inside is an old calendar from the beginning of 21X. Man, this music. Oh, this is... The music from the beginning, right? This is the music from the cutscene from the beginning. This is it. A room of your own. I hope you like it. This is weird, man. No, don't touch my head. Don't. Is something burning? M make yourself at home. What if I call her? Say hello. Mrs. Toriel, are you bored? I should have given a book to you. My apologies. Why not use your imagination to divert yourself? Pretend you are a monarch. Rule over the leaf pile with a fist of iron. Can you do that for me? Click. Okay, so last time we were being a little conservative. We didn't want to flirt. But this time, let be, let's be a little bit more adventurous. Let's flirt. Huh? Well, she, she seems a little bit embarrassed. How adorable, I could pinch her cheek. You can certainly find better than an old woman like me. That was a very weird interaction. Call her mom. Dialing. This is Toriel. Huh? Did you just call me mom? Well, I suppose... Would that make you happy? To call me mother? 
Well then, call me whatever you like. Okay. That was exactly as awkward that I, as I suspected. We have seen this type, this type of plant before, but do not know its name. So this is my room. Mmm. Cool toys, they don't interest you at all. An empty photo frame. box of kids shoes in this in a disparity of sizes oh wow I can turn off the lights this is weird I just fell into this hole and these people expect me to just live here no don't don't sleep we found a slice of butterscotch cinnamon pie okay uh, butterscotch pie. Info. All HP. Okay, so I guess it recovers. One. It, it recovers all the HP. Uh, can I leave? this oh that's Toriel's room read the diary yes read the passage why did the skeleton want a friend because she was feeling bonely the rest of the page is filled with jokes of a similar caliber so she's a mom but she does dad jokes regular old bucket of snails you ah the cactus truly the most sundere of plants you peek inside scan oh my god jesus scandalous oh sock okay sock sock drawer it's, ju it's just a sock drawer It's an encyclopedia of subterranean plants. You open to the middle. Typha, a group of wetland flowering plants with brown oblong seed pods. Known more commonly as water sausages. If I interact with this bed, am I gonna sleep in her bed? That would be weird, man. Definitely bigger than a twin sized bed. Okay, so I didn't sleep in it. Good. Th there was more... Let me see. There was more stuff to explore there over to the left. Oh, a mirror! It's you! It's a water sausage. Okay. Room under renovations. Okay, there was more stuff to explore, let me... Let me see here... What's over here? Oh, it's, it's her! She's reading a book! A history book. Here's a random page. Trapped behind the barrier and fearful of f further human attacks, we retreated. Okay, so they're telling the lore of the monsters. Far, far into the earth we walked until we reached the cavern's end. This was our new home, which we named... Home. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. As great as our king is, he's pretty lousy at Names. The ends of the tools have been filled down to make them safer. She read, yes. Best Freddy. She read. 
The fire isn't burning hot, just pleasantly warm. You could put your hand inside. That's not that's not how fire works. Up already, I see. Hmm, I want you to know how glad I am to have someone here. There's so many old books I want to share. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. Okay. I've also prepared a curriculum for your education. What? This may come as a surprise to you. But I have always wanted to be a teacher. She does feel, feel like the kind of teacher type. Actually, perhaps that isn't very surprising. Oh, yeah, it isn't surprising. I just... Still! I'm glad to have you live in here. Oh, did you want something? What is it? When can I go home? That's exactly what I want to know. What? This... This is your home now. Oh, no, I don't like this. Would you like to know about this book that I'm reading? It's called 72 Uses for Snails. How about it? Uh, sure. Here's an exciting snail fact. Did you know that snails have a chainsaw-like tongue called radula? Interesting. Yeah, I just, I just want to see how far she will go with snail trivia well bother me if you need anything else oh, okay i i thought she was she was going to keep going on about snails yeah red flags crafty little soto says red flags when she starts going off about snails okay so how to exit the ruins i have to do something stay here She, she always goes away and tells me to stay. Can I sit here? Seems like the right size for Toriel. I'm not gonna wait for you. Oh, a kitchen. For some reason, there's, there's a brand name chocolate bar in the fridge. Oh, a fridge. I'm glad Toriel has a fridge. I've learned to to value fridges. Let's just say that. There's some white fur stuck in the drain. Inside the cupboard are cookie cutters for gingerbread monsters. The size of the pie intimidates you too much for you to eat it. The stove top is very clean. Toriel must use fire magic instead. Fire magic? Yeah, Abigail. Fridge Envy. And Lassinalma Lass says, I hope you don't have to carry the fridge again. I already carried it twice, but I think that will be it, because now it's back here and it's working. So, enough carrying fridges. Is she in her room, maybe? No. Oh! I can still keep... I can still keep... flirting with her. Dial in. Nobody picked up. Okay. What if I... Dial in. Nobody picked up. Uh, some of the options in the phone, they disappear once you try them once. But flirt just... Stays there, I guess. Yes, you can. You can keep flirting with her. So this is the only path left. Oh, hey. You wish to know how to return home, do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. A one-way exit to the rest of the underground. I'm going to... Destroy it? Why? No one will ever be able to leave again. Oh, I, I knew she, she was too weird. She was too attached. 
Yeah, the music is gone. Kamau says. It was kind of creepy. There's some some creepy sound effects. Okay, so she's too attached. She doesn't want me to leave. I I knew this was going to happen. Now be a good child and go upstairs. No. Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. Okay, so I'm not the first person to fall here. I have seen it again and again. They come, they leave. Yes, that's that's normal. You're not you're not supposed to be upset by that. They die. Whoa. You naive child, if you leave the ruins, they, Asgore will kill you. Oh wow, I know, I, I've, I have a little bit of context for this game because of the tracks that I have uh, reacted to. So I know Asgore is like the king of the monsters, I think, something like that. I am only protecting you, do, do you understand? Go to your room. Nope. I want to leave. Do not try to stop me. This is your final warning. Uh, I guess I'm gonna fight her now. Do you want to leave so badly? We're just like the others. There's only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. Oh! Oh yeah, this song, I reacted to this, this song. So, last stream, I learned that I can spare or I can kill the monsters. So... I'll, I'm gonna try to spare her. Let's check. Hurry up. Attack 80. Knows best for you. Okay. Wow. Oh man, am I gonna be able to do this? That, that was kinda hard. There's a magical attack. Talk! You couldn't think of any conversation topics. Man! I have items if I need to. Talk. We try to think of something to say again, but... Oh man. Should I... Should I heal? Let's try again. Ironically, talking does not seem to be the solution to this situation. Okay, some people are saying the music is loud. Some people are saying the music is fine. Okay, talking is not the solution. Wow, this is... Okay, I have to heal. I have to heal. Uh, I guess the pie restores everything. Let's go for the for the pie. Okay. Oh wow. Magical attack.
I'm trying to talk and nothing is happening. When I when I tried to spare the, the ghost last time, the dialogue was changing every time. Ironically, talking does not seem to be the solution. So the dialogue is not changing. Looks through me. Did I fight? Looks through me. Is this one of those? I wonder if this is one of those boss fights that you're supposed to lose. Because this was was a big seems like a big difficulty spike. I think I think I'm gonna try fighting next time. Okay, let's... I don't want to fight, but like nothing's happening. I'm, I'm, try I'm gonna try fighting. Like when you when you're able to spare, the spare thing becomes yellow, right? So I can't spare. It's a deep breath. Okay, so this is new. Acting aloof, so okay, so stuff is changing here. There's new stuff happening. Okay. Okay, so now she's avoiding me. Okay, so I'm 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 doing it. She doesn't want to fight me either. And I think the fact that I'm trying to spare her, I think it's kind of messing her up. See, it's changing. Man, it, it's this game is crazy because it keeps throwing different stuff at you. I, I tried to go about this battle in the same way that I did with the ghost battle, but it's different. The game forces you to think of different, to try different stuff. What are you doing? Okay, so I guess I'll, I'll just keep doing it because the dialogue keeps changing. Attack or run away? Nope. I'm gonna spare. What are you proving this way? I'm proving that... You taught me, you know, she taught me to spare people. So I think this kind of... Fight me or leave. This... This messes with her feelings. To see me try to spare her. Stop it. Stop looking at me that way. So I guess I can... Because when I attacked her, her health goes down. So I guess I, I can kill her if I want to. Go away. It's taking a long time. 
I guess they're, they're testing... They're testing my... Perseverance. Or determination, right? Her facial expression is changing. But this is sure taking a long time. Okay, I did it, I guess. I know you want to go home, but... Okay, so the music is gone. Can I talk now? Talk. Ironically, talking does not seem to be the solution to this situation. Oh, I, th I thought it would let me talk now, but I guess spare. Go upstairs now. Promise I will take good care of you here. I don't want you. I don't want you to. You're a goat. I know we do not have much, but... We can have a good life here. Why are you making this so difficult? Why are you making this so difficult? This is, this is looking like a true... Like child and parent argument now. Please go upstairs. No, you you go upstairs. Aha. Pathetic, is it not? I cannot save even a single child. No, I understand. The dialogue keeps changing. There's so much I, I assume optional dialogue. You would just be unhappy trapped down here. Okay, so now she she understands. The ruins are very small once you get used to them. It would not be right for you to grow up in a place like this. My expectations, my loneliness, my fear. Oh wow, this is getting kind of deep and real. For you, my child, I will put them aside. Thank you, Jesus. If you truly wish to leave the ruins. Okay, so that, that means I kind of wasted a healing item. I guess. Well, I, I don't know. I don't know what would have what would have happened if I died. If you truly wish to leave the ruins, I will not stop you. However, when you leave, please do not come back. I hope you understand. Don't hug me. I met you like thirty minutes ago. Goodbye, my child. I bet she smells like goat. And Kamal says, you need more mods. Uh, the mods thing, you know, I made Abigail a mod. And I said this to Froggy last time too. Last stream. Uh, and I'm gonna say this again to Abigail. Abigail, don't please don't feel obligated to do anything. If you have to leave, you can leave. If you don't want to deal with uh, any nonsense in the chat, uh, don't don't feel obligated to. The thing with mods, it, it's kind of I always I always feel kind of weird to to ask my friends to you know they, they're here to hang out to watch something entertaining and. To put on them this burden of, you know, watching the chat and banning people and this kind of stuff always feels kind of weird. So when the chat becomes kind of crazy and starts backseating and giving spoilers, I just don't don't look at it. Uh, but I, I don't. I feel kind of weird asking my friends to be the chat police. If they want to, that's that's fine, but. Okay, so now we're walking. Oh yeah, we all, almost have 300 people now. So yeah, I told you guys that the stream was going to be... Oh, the, it's the flower again. Clever, very clever. Oh wow, this flower deceived us at the beginning. Ass assuming it's the same one. You think you're really smart, don't you? Oh, and I... 
I should have healed. I, I think I have 3 HP. Damn it. In this world, it's kill or be killed. You were able to play by your own rules. You spared the life of a single person. Okay. What? Is he listing the monsters that I... Spared? Because I, I didn't kill all this. I, I think I killed like a frog or something. Or two. So I think this is the, the people that I spared. Think about those names. You think any of those monsters have families? So these, these are the monsters that I killed. I don't remember killing so many. You think any of them have friends? Each one could have been someone else's Toriel. Oh, wow. Selfish brat. Somebody's dead because of you. Oh, come on, it was a frog. Okay. Are you done? Okay, so I should heal. I have 2 HP. Uh, should I heal? I don't know. Can I still call her? Say hello. Nobody picked up. She's she's hurt. Uh, I'm I'm afraid of. I'm afraid of keeping going. With this little HP. Let's wait, let's wait and see what happens. Whoa! A logo! So that was kind of the, the intro, I guess, to the game. There's a camera hidden in the bushes. What? Yeah, credits roll. Imagine. The game is just over. So this is a new area. There's no music. It was kind of kind of creepy. Okay, there's some scary noises. More scary noises. Uh, this doesn't look safe. Oh, I know who this is. Everybody knows, knows who this is. Human. Don't you know how to greet a new pal? Turn around and shake my hand. So this, by the silhouette, I imagine this is Sans, right? Uh, Was that a fart joke? Whoopy cushion in the hand trick. Oh, now we have some music. It's always funny. The... Did the font of the text change? Wait. Is this Comic Sans? And he's called Sans. Whoa. 
Wow. Okay, so you're a human, right? That's hilarious. Why, why is that hilarious? I'm Sense. Sense the skeleton. I'm actually supposed to be on watch for humans right now. But, you know, I don't really, really care about capturing anybody. Now, my brother Papyrus, Papyrus, is a human hunting fanatic. Hey, actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate thingy. Yeah, go right through. My bro made the bars too wide to stop anyone. Quick, behind that conveniently shaped lamp. Wow, this that's very conveniently shaped indeed. What's up, bro? Oh, this music. Have you guys seen the, the video from yesterday on the main channel? But this, this is not the version I reacted to. This version sounds a little bit softer. What's up, bro? Whoa. Chill, chill out with the all caps. Man, you know what? Sup, brother? It's been eight days and you still haven't recalibrated your puzzles. You just hang around outside your station. What are you even doing? Staring at this lamp. It's really cool. Do you want to look? No, I don't have time for that. Oh, he's angry. What if a human comes through here? I want to be ready. I will be the one. I must be the one. I will capture a human. Oh man, so I guess... I guess Toriel was really trying to protect me, I guess. Then I, the great Papyrus, will get all the things I utterly deserve. Respect. Recognition. I will finally be able to join the Royal Guard. People will ask. To be my friend. I will bathe in a shower of kisses every morning. Okay. Maybe this lamp will help you. So, it's giving me away. Sense, you're not helping. You lazy bones. All you do is sit and boondoggle. What is boondoggle? You get lazier and lazier every day. Hey, take it easy, I've gotten a ton of work done today. A ton is yellow, for some reason. A skeleton. <laughs> oh my god. Sans. Come on, you're, you're smiling. I am and I hate it. That's exactly how I feel. Why does someone as great as me have to do so much just to get some recognition? Wow, sounds, sounds like you're really working yourself. Down to the bone. But Good. I like sense. I like sense. I will attend to my puzzles. As for your work, put a little more backbone into it. <laughs> okay, you can come out now. You ought to get going. He might come back, and if he does, you'll have to sit through more of his, through more of my hilarious jokes. Yeah, let's. Let's not do that. There's nothing to be afraid of. It's just a dark cavern filled with skeletons and horrible monsters. Well, you ought to get going. Just a conveniently shaped lamp. I guess this is his post. It's some sort of checkpoint. 
for Sentry Station. There are bottles of ketchup, mustard, and relish sitting out sitting inside. Actually, hey, hate to bother ya, but can you do me a favor? I was thinking, my brother's been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before, and seeing you might just make his day. Uh, but he wants to capture me. Don't worry, he's not dangerous. Okay. Yeah, he, he doesn't look dangerous. Even if he tries to be. <laughs> Thanks a million. I'll be up ahead. Oh, now we have some music. Piano and snow go very well together. Snowy areas, piano music. Very good choice. Okay, so we can save here. The convenience of that lamp still fills you with determination. And Water Dragon says, just out of curiosity, what are your what are your rules on cursing? You can curse if you want. I don't care. Just don't be a douche to anyone specifically okay so save this is a box and put an item inside or take an item out same box will appear later so don't worry about coming back sincerely a box lover okay so I can store items I don't think I have anything to store I just heard a... I just heard another... Mitsuda leak, do you guys remember? I, I talked about it in the video. But there's another one. Let me see if I can find it. I don't know when it's going to repeat again. I guess I can put away the stick. I swear I heard it. Let's put away the stick. What's a tough glove? Tough glove. I'm, I'm half paying attention to the game and half... Trying to find the Mitsuda leak again. <gasps> it, it was right there. It was right there. I, I talked over it, but it was right there. Yeah. So I, I talked in the video. I said that I was not sure if the Mitsuda leak was intentional or not. But now uh, it's, it's pretty clear that it's intentional. Because he's doing it again. Tough glove. Weapon. Attack 5. A worn pink leather glove for five fingered folk. That's... that's me. I'm a five-fingered individual. Uh, is that better than my... Tough glove. Yeah, it's better. 
Uh, should I put... Oh, a battle. Snow Drake flutters forth. Let's... Let's laugh. To laugh at the snow trick before it says anything funny. What are you laughing at? Oh man, that was very easy and I and I messed it up. It smells like a wet pillow. Joke. You make a bad ice pun. <laughs> nice try. Drake is assessing the crowd. You tell the Snow Drake that they aren't funny. Snow Drake realizes its own name is a pun and is freaking out. So I guess to spare this guy, I guess I have to no drink. This team comedian fights to keep a captive audience. Better not snowflake out. Own bad joke. See? Laughs. That was wrong. He's pleased with this cool joke. Okay, so now I can spare. Whee! Okay. Uh, I'm not gonna put anything away for now. I don't know if I'm gonna need the knife or something. Uh, oh, fishing rod. It's a fishing rod affixed to the ground. Uh, reel it in, yes. Photo of a weird looking monster. Here's my number. Okay. And I guess this number thing reminds me of Toriel. I guess she won't pick up. She won't pick up anymore. He's mad at me. Whoa, here they are. So, as I was saying about Undine, 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 and here's the music again. Sans, oh my god, is that a human? Actually, I think that's that's a rock. Hey, what's that in front of the rock? Oh my god! Is is that a human? Yes! Oh my god! Sens, I finally did it! Undyne will I'm gonna I'll be so popular! So I guess I know from my video that we get to fight Papyrus later, so I guess he's gonna try to capture us. Human, you shall not pass this area. I, the great Papyrus, will stop you. I will then capture you, you will be delivered to the capital, then, then... I'm not sure what's next. In any case, continue only if you dare. 
<laughs> well, that went well. Don't sweat it, kid. Keep an eye socket out for you. <laughs> yeah, Papyrus is... is Gandalf. Refrigerator! That's... Okay, I know... I know this is a coincidence, but it's... Jesus! Talking about ref my refrigerator running... Man, <laughs> that was weird! Oh, I, that got scary for a second! Talking about my refrigerator running when I I was just talking about my refrigerator problems. What the hell, man? This game is crazy. <laughs> yeah, it's running. My refrigerator is running. It wasn't running like yesterday, but now it is. Nice. I'll be over to deposit the brewskis. What was that, man? Jesus. Crazy game. Ice cap struts into view. Uh, check. This teen wonders why it isn't named Ice Hat. I just love my hat, okay? Certain article of clothing. Yeah, let's compliment. He has a great hat. Oof. This cat also wants a hat for its nose. So I can steal his hat. Okay. But if I ignore, you manage to tear your eyes away from Ice Cap's hat. He looks annoyed. Secretly checking if you're looking at his hat. I'm just ignoring you. You continue not looking at Ascap's hat. It seems defeated. Okay, I'll ignore you too. It's desperate for attention. Okay, so now I can spare. Spare. So each enemy, each each different enemy is kind of like a puzzle in and of itself. Cool. There's some narration on this cardboard box. You observe the well-crafted sentry station. Who could have built this, you ponder? I bet it was that very famous royal guardsman. Note, not yet a very famous royal guardsman. Okay, so that was a purist... Yeah, refrigerators, right? Simperoni says, gotta love the mystery man in the refrigerators. What was that man with the refrigerator? What are the chances? Absolutely no moving. No moving? Who? Did something move? Was it my imagination? I can only see moving things. If something was moving, for example, a human, I'll make sure he never moves again. Just 
so... Do I just do nothing? I feel like if I move the, the, the cursor... He's gonna see it. But maybe I'm just thinking way too deeply about this. Okay, I'm gonna move. I'm gonna move. The, the problem with these games that mess that that tend to mess with you and you no know, fourth wall breaking stuff is that you you start thinking too deeply about everything. Okay, so I'm gonna move. Uh, doggo. Check. Easily excited by movement. Hobbs include squirrels. Oh man, I I knew there was a trick to that. They they were trying to make me move. Didn't seem to find anything. What if I pet him? You pet doggo. What? I've been pet. <laughs> oh my god, dude is losing his mind. Dogo has been pet, yes. Oh, now I can spare. Spare! You won! So, this is crazy. I could have been killing all these NPCs. Something pet me. Something that isn't moving. I'm gonna need some dog treats for this. Okay, so I, can I move now? Hello? Is anybody there? No. Okay, I guess I'll move along. Someone has been smoking dog treats! Smoking dog treats. Okay. Let's leave. Hey, Sans. Hey, here's something important to remember. My brother has a very special attack. If you see a blue attack, don't move and he won't hurt you. Oh yeah, just like what happened now with the, with the dog. Here's an easy way to keep it in mind. Imagine a stop sign. When you see a stop sign, you stop, right? Yes. Stop signs are red. So imagine a blue... Oh, okay. Simple, right? So he's telling me... He's telling me if I see blue, I stop. I think. Okay. Remember, blue stop signs. Okay. Uh, oh, okay. One of those. Whoa, lesser dog. <laughs> pet, 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 pet. Okay, let's pet. You barely lifted your hand and lesser dog got excited. Oof. Lesser dog is barking excitedly. Hey, Abigail. Abigail is back. Hey, Abigail. Welcome back! Okay. Oh, I can already. Pretty easy. Just like real life, it's pretty easy to please a dog. Uh. North, ice, south, ice, west, ice. East, snowed in town. And ice. There's a town. But what's over here? Oh. Are you gonna fight me? Hello. 
I am a snowman. I want to see the world that I cannot move. If you would be so kind, traveler, please. Take a piece of me and bring it very far away. Uh, you're probably gonna melt though. Thank you, good luck. You got this snowman piece. Snowman piece. Info. Heals 45... Oh! Heals 45 HP, I can't eat it. I haven't given up on Toriel. Nobody picked up. You're so lazy! You were napping all night. I think that's called <laughs> sleeping. Yeah, that makes sense. Excuses, excuses, excuses. Oh, the human arrives! In order to stop you, my brother and I have created some puzzles. I think you will find this one quite shocking. For you see, this is the invisible electricity maze. When you touch the walls of this maze, it, this orb will administer a hearty zap. Sound like fun? Because the amount of fun you will probably have is actually rather small, I think. Okay, you can go ahead now. Uh... <laughs> what? Sans, what did you do? I think the human has to hold the <laughs> the or... Yeah, that makes sense. Okay. <laughs> okay, hold this please. Try now. Uh, I wonder what happens if I actually mess it up. Incredible, <laughs> you slippery snail. You solved it so easily, too easily. However, the next puzzle will not be easy. It is designed by my brother Sans. You will surely be confounded. No, I am. <laughs> This guy has a, has a signature laugh. Hey, thanks. My brother seems like he's having fun. By the way, did you see that weird outfit he's wearing? We made that a few weeks ago for a costume party. He hasn't worn anything else since. He keeps calling it his battle body. Isn't my brother cool? He looks kind of like a tryhard. But he seems... yeah, he seems cool. Hey, thanks, my brother seems... okay. Whoa, who are you? I don't understand why these aren't selling. The perfect weather for something cold. Uh, oh, customer, would you like some nice cream? It's the frozen treat that warms your heart. Now just 15. Uh, yes, sure. I have, a pl I have plenty of money. Here you go. Have a super duper day. Nice cream. Info. He was 15 HP. Instead of a joke, the rapper says something nice. I... I'm low on HP. Should I heal? The, the thing with healing in this game is that I feel like every one of these items might be useful. There's no, like, potion. There's no, like... Uh, generic healing item so I never feel like I feel like I'm wasting stuff and I don't even know what happens if you die I've never died 
I don't know if it's a big deal or not. Uh, what is this? Whoa! Let's play... Let's play football! Whee! Wow. I'm Pele! Oh. Yay! What happened? Purple. Even when you felt trapped, you took notes and achieved the end of ball. You are awarded two gold. Okay. This looks it looks like a snowball. Ronaldinho soccer! Yes! A snow cathedral. Sands was right there. I've been thinking about selling treats too. I want some, want some fried snow. Yes, I want some fried snow. Fifty. No, that's like all all the money I have. You're right. <laughs> that's still too low. What's over here? Okay, nothing here. Oh, wait, what's over there? So, Sans is kind of like a an interesting individual. He's here and he's over there at the same time. Whoa. Are there dogs here? Smell danger rating. Snow smell. What are you saying? Snow, snow smell, snowman. White rating can become yellow rating. Unsuspicious smell. Puppy. Blue rating. Smell of rolling around. Weird smell. Humans. Green rating. Destroy at all costs. I don't. His. Oh! These are. Toilets. Is this a joke? Okay, so let's move on. Human! I hope you're ready for... Also, oh, another puzzle. Sons, where's the puzzle? It's right there, on the ground. Trust me, there's no way they can get past this one. Uh, let's... Let's see about that. Monster Kids Word Search Hey kids, can you help me solve this puzzle? Uh, great! Uh, great! Sense <laughs> that didn't do anything! Whoops! I knew I should have used today's crossword instead. Crossword? I can't believe you said that! In my opinion, Junior Jumbo is easily the hardest. Really dude, that easy peasy word scramble? That's for baby bones. Unbelievable! Human, solve this dispute! Which is harder? Cr depending... Crossword can be very hard depending on the, the words. You are weird. Crosswords are so easy. It's the same solution every time. I just fill out the boxes with the letter Z. Uh, 
that's not that's not how because every time I look at a crossword all I can do is snore yeah <laughs> Finds difficulty in interesting places. Yesterday he got stumped trying to solve the horoscope. Okay, so I guess we're just moving on. Uh, and we can save again. Oh, there's a mouse again. I never see this mouse. Knowing the mouse might one day find a way to heat up the spaghetti. Fills you with determination. It's a note from Papyrus. Human, please enjoy the spaghetti. Little do you know, this spaghetti is a trap designed to entice you. You'll be so busy eating it that you won't realize that you aren't progressing. Thoroughly japed again by the great Papyrus. Dude, to think that you can kill these guys, that's crazy. I would never kill Papyrus. It's a plate of frozen spaghetti. It's so cold, it's stuck to the table. An unplugged microwave. All of the settings says they spaghetti. Interesting. One day, the mouse. What, what did it say? The mouse might one day find a way to heat the spaghetti. That's very inspiring. Oh, Abigail, have you played Undertale? I didn't know you... you played it. Warning, dog marriage. Uh, okay. I am... I am... appropriately warned about dog marriage. Oh man, so many of them. When there's multiple monsters, it's so, so hard. Okay, let's... Oh! So I, di I did well not to heal. Because when you save, apparently, you heal. Jerry. Who's Jerry? Everyone knows Jerry. Oh no! Two seconds longer. I want to get rid of Jerry first. And I ditch. Ditch Jerry when he looks away. Okay. So, Ice Cap. Let's ignore Ice Cap. Here. 
some of these fights can be very long. Return of Jerry. So ice cap, ignore. So how do I spare Jerry? Awkward. How do I... Ditch. Check Jerry. Wait, no, I have checked Jerry already. Great. So I guess I can't spare Jerry. Nothing here. What is this? There's an X. The Mitsuda Lick, Mitsuda Lick again. Every now and then it catches my attention in the background. Again. Okay, I don't need to do this again, do you? Do do I? Please. Uh seems like a map. Dog marriage? <laughs> yes, you read that correctly. Dog marriage. Oh. It, oh, it's a map of this. There's a switch, oh, okay, it's a map of this area. Click. Do I get anything if I keep doing this? Drake, laugh. Without covering his nose, man. Look at Jerry. Okay, now I can spare. Whoa. Smells like Jerry. They ditch me. Jerry sneezes. What do I do with Jerry? Everyone knows Jerry. Well, you give me a ride home. <laughs> Jerry's such a Jerry. Eats powdery food and licks its hand loudly. You 
will give me a ride home. Okay, so I guess. Can I sp there? They ditch me. Yeah, I guess. I guess I can spare him. Maybe an item or something. Ah, okay, now the spikes are down. Whoa! What's that smell? Oh, man! If your smell... Identify your smell. What? Use that weird smell. Makes me want to eliminate. Eliminate you. Doggy assault you. Oh, they're kissing. Okay. Dogami dogaresa. Uh. Can I pet you? Would you like that? Dogs are too suspicious of your smell. <laughs> That's not your husband, okay? What? The blue hurt me! Oh, did it hurt me because I moved? Ah, okay. So blue... Okay, I get it now. Blue hurts me if I move through it. Dogs are practicing for the next couples contest. Uh, check. Husband of Dogaressa knows only what he smells. Damn it. Reevaluating my smell. Re sniff. smell just as weird as before what whoa the dogs are practicing for the next couple's contest roll around I'm dying I'm kind of curious to see what happens if I die. I'm guessing I just go back to the previous save point. So I guess I'm, I'm not gonna heal. Let's just roll with it. Roll around. That's the only one I haven't done yet, I think. Roll around in the dirt and snow. Smell like a weird puppy. Uh, Jesus. That one's too hard. Okay, so I died. You cannot give up just yet. Tofi! Stay determined! I am determined. Okay. Okay, so we just go back. I thought some creepy thing might happen. There's a switch. So, that stuff with the smells. Yeah, 
There was a sign before talking about smells and I didn't understand any of it. I guess that was important. What's that smell? So the... When I rolled around, it did something to, to my smell. You smell like a weird puppy. Dogs may want to re-smell you. Okay, so re-smell me. Sniff you again. Smell alright. Okay. That one is so hard, man. Dogs th think that you may be a lost puppy. Uh... I pet you now. Pet the gummy. Okay. Like, I don't know how, how to escape this one. Let's heal. Uh, spider donut. Bet her and let's pray. No, dog's minds have been expanded. Okay, so nice cream. I don't know how to escape that, that big one. Oh! Okay. I, I still got hit once, but I guess you have to go under them twice. Oh, I can't spare. Jesus. Thank God. Okay. Dogs can pet other dogs? A new world has opened up for us. Thanks, weird puppy. Great! I wasted two... I, I almost, almost want to... To reset. Because I wasted two... Two healing items, but just... Let's continue. Let's be true to ourselves. Turn every axe into an... Oh, then press the switch. Okay. Oh, look who's, who's here. What? How did you avoid my trap? And more importantly, is there any left for me? What do you tell Papyrus about his spaghetti? It's all there, man. But let, let's let's trigger. I want to see trigger papyrus. I ate it. Yes. Wow. No one's ever enjoyed my cooking before. Oh, so he's flattered. Well then, fret not, human. I, Master Chef Papyrus, will make you all the pasta you could ever want. <laughs> okay. So turn. Every accent to an O. 
Yes, I have to leave. Oh, okay. X to an O. Whee! Okay, that was easy. Uh, hey! What's up, man? My brother started a sock collection recently. How saddening. Sometimes I wonder what he would do without such a cool guy taking care of him. You got anything else to say? My brother started a sock collection. Okay. Human! How do I say this? You are taking a long time to arrive. Is that is he saying this because I actually took a long time? Or does he say that every time? I decided to improve this puzzle by arranging the snow to look more like my face. Unfortunately, the snow froze to the ground. So the solution is different. And as usual, my lazy brother is nowhere around. I suppose what I'm saying is... Worry not, human. I, the great Papyrus, will solve this conundrum. And we can both proceed. Meanwhile, you're free to try the puzzle yourself. I'll try not to give away the answer. Turn every accent to an O, then press the switch. Uh... If I step on them twice, they become a triangle. it up can I leave can I talk to you you want a hint well I've been looking at the puzzle and I think the solution is to turn all of the X into oh, oh that's very helpful Ask again for great hints. And solving the last puzzle again will help. Ask again for more great hints. Solving the last puzzle. puzzle I can reset it. So, you want a hint, huh? I've been looking at the puzzle. Okay, so he just does the same thing. Hmm.
What? This... Some of them here... I have... There's one of them here that I, I think I have to leave for last. Okay, so... Check this out. I didn't know you could do that. That's why I, I was having so, so much trouble. I didn't know I could step on them and, and go back. Oh, I guess that's why he, he told me to... Okay, I guess that's why he told me to do the, the previous one. Yeah, that's on me. That, that's... Uh... I misunderstood the rules, I guess. My advice helped you, really helped you. It, it didn't really, but that's on me. <laughs> that that was on me. Incredible, I'm impressed. You must care about puzzles like I do. Well, I'm sure you'll love the next puzzle then. It might even be too easy for you. Okay. So you guys understood what I said. I I thought if I if I did this and then went back. It would turn into a triangle. Good job on solving it so quickly. Didn't even, didn't even need my help. Which is great, because I love doing absolutely nothing. No sense. What is this? Hey, it's the human. You're gonna love this puzzle. It was made by the great Dr. Alphys. You see these tiles? Once I throw the switch, they will begin to change color. Each color has a different function. Red tiles are impassable. You cannot walk on them. Yellow tiles are electric. Electrocute you. Green tiles are alarm tiles. If you step on them, you will have to fight a monster. Orange tiles are orange scented. They will make you smell delicious. Man, that, that's a lot of tiles. Blue tiles are water tiles. Been through if you like, but you, you, if you smell like oranges, the piranhas will bite you. Also, if a blue tile is next to a yellow tile, the water will also zap you. Purple tiles are slippery. You will slide through the next tile. However, the slippery soap smells like lemons, which piranhas do not like. Purple and blue are okay. Okay. Uh, finally, pink tiles. Okay, there's the, the pink tiles. Of course. They don't do anything. Step on them all you like. How was that? Understand? I... I understand. Even the simpler puzzle from before, I had a hard time understanding. But yeah, sure. Of, of course. Great. And there's one last thing. This puzzle is entirely random. When I pull this switch, it will make a puzzle that has never been seen before. But even I will know the solution. Yeah. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> okay. Great. M maybe... Maybe it wasn't... 
a good idea to make the puzzle completely random. Actually, a spaghetti from earlier. It wasn't too bad for my brother. As he started cooking lessons, he's been improving a lot. I bet if he keeps up next year, he'll even make something edible. Yeah, you guys are saying incredible stroke of luck. It's like this every time. Streamer luck. Yeah, right. What a trolley game. The machine isn't working. Trolley ass game. Streamer luck, right? Oh, a dog. This dog is staring blankly into the snow, waiting for it to turn into art. On the floor inside is a bo box of pomeranians. Aware of dog. Please pet dog. Sure, I can pet you. This dog is staring blankly. Okay. Whoa. Knowing that dog will never give up trying to make the perfect snow dog. It fills you with determination save you've been playing for two hours Ooh. that dog considers itself an artist it doesn't ever know what to create it probably doesn't help that its brain is the size of a piece of kibble Well, he's trying his best, okay? Oh, another puzzle. What's over here? It's a snow papyrus. <laughs> it's a lump of snow with the word Sans written on it. Sans doesn't even care. He doesn't even care. And Xavier asks, how long do you plan on playing? Uh, we've been live for an hour and 40 minutes. I think we can go like two hours and a little bit, I think. It's a snow papyrus. Uh, Yeah, it's Pokemon time, right? David Best said. The There's a bunch of these lighting puzzles in Pokemon. And in Zelda as well. Reminds me of... Whoa, I fell. Whoa. What's up? Oh, this is where I was. It's a snow puff. And this is a snow puff. What about this? This, however, is a snow puff. But how about this, though? Surprisingly, is a snow puff. And what about this? Snow puff. But this, though, is. It is. Is it really a snow puff? And I assume this is... Behold, a snow puff. And this... Eh? <laughs> I knew, I knew there was some... Some... Reward for this. Whoa! A dog! Whoa. It's the greater dog. Okay. Check. 
Creature dog. It's so excited that it thinks fighting is just play. I have known some real life dogs just like that. D damn. I have to time it with the blue. He's waiting for my command. Pet. It's too far away to pet. Just pet the air. Wait. Oh, damn. I I I have to stand still. I have to time it. Uh okay. I have to time it right so it will grow through me as I stand still. Uh play. It's not excited enough. Beckon. Oh, the greater dog. It bounced toward you, flacking slobber into your face. So now he's close to me, I guess I can pet him. Seeking affection. So yeah, let's pet. Oh, he curls up in my lap. He's kind of he's kind of large though. He gets so comfortable, he falls asleep. Then he wakes up. He's so excited. Okay, so now I can play. Damn it! I keep forgetting about the blue rule. Uh, play. Throw it for the dog. Fetch. It splats on the ground. Greater dog picks up all the snow in the area and brings it to you. Now the dog is very tired. It rests its head on you. Greater dog wants some TLC. What is TLC? I guess I'm... I'm low on HP though. This was so easy, I kept forgetting the... the blue thing. I took a lot of damage. Oh, TLC, Tender Loving Care. Uh... I'm kind of far away. Am I far away from the last save? Yeah, let's see. I don't want to go back. I don't remember when the... How, how far away was the last save. Okay, so let's ignore him because... So we pet him, we played with him, now he's tired. Inches closer. DLC, so I guess he wants to be pet. You pet the dog, it sinks his entire weight into you. The movement's slow, but you still haven't pet enough. Pet capacity is a 40%. Pet decisively. Pet capacity reaches 100%. The dog flops over with its legs hanging in the air. Greater dog is contented. Oh, nice. Spare. You won. Man. Okay, uh, there was another thing.
There was another path though. Oof. It must be bigger on the inside. Wasn't there a path down here? Oh no, I don't know where to go. Final and most dangerous challenge. I'm afraid now that they're, they're gonna they're not gonna allow me to go back. I think there was a another path. Behold the gauntlet of deadly terror. <laughs> There's a little dog. When I when I say the word, I will it will fully activate. Candles will fire, spikes will swing, blades will slice. Each part will swing violently up and down, including the dog. That's, that's interesting. Only the tiniest chance of victory will remain. Are you ready? Because I am about to do it. Uh, well, what's the hold up? Hold up, what hold up? I'm about to activate it now. Yeah, it's, it's kind of taking long, man. That uh, doesn't look very activated. Well, this challenge, it seems, maybe, too easy to defeat the human with. Yeah, you can't use this one. I'm a skeleton with standards. Okay, my puzzles are very fair. And my traps are expertly cooked. But this method is too direct. No class at all. The way it goes. Yeah. What are you looking at? This was another decisive victory for Papyrus. Uh, I want. Is does this happen every time? I wonder if it has something to do with the spaghetti. Yeah. Okay, so they'll let me go back. back to that place we haven't seen what is this gift dropped confronts you uh, you are a weird little guy decorate okay Some teams decorated it as a prank. Leave me alone. Okay, he wants to be left alone. Uh, let's undecorate. Remove the box of non-dog related raisins. That's a little better. I'm really bad at, the, at these bullet hell things. Oh. I'm gonna use up all of the. Oh, I don't wanna die. It's been a while. The, the snow thing was probably important, but. The lenticular bookmark of a smug teen winky. That's a little better. I just I just remembered that I can flee as well if ever I get in a in a pinch. Remove the stripped cane that says I use this tiny cane to walk. 
on it. Okay. So I guess now I've been taken away. Okay, great. What's over here? Whoa. So is this where I have to go or is that where I have to go? It's a door. Okay, it's a door. Okay, so I can't progress here. Yeah, it's a door. Fast ready. Oh, it's kind of dark here. Okay, so let's go back. I haven't been here yet. It's Jerry again. Come on. No way, Jerry. So what's over here? Welcome. Oh, that's the town they, they talked about. Snowed in town. Is this where they live? Like Sans and Pyrrhus? They can save here. The sight of such a friendly town fills you with determination. So, in the song here... It's a little bit more upbeat version of the previous track. Don't want to walk to the other side of town? Try the under snow tunnels. They're efficiently laid out. Whoa! It's a big town. That lady over there, something about her disturbs me. This lady? Isn't my little cinnamon just the cutest? Bun buns are so adorable. She looks... Bun 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 bun. Yeah, now... Now I see what you mean. I was about to say she looks pretty normal. Bun 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 bun. Awful teens tormented a local monster by decorating its tree like horns. Yeah, I saw it. We started giving that monster presents to make it feel better. Now it's a tradition to put presents underneath a decorated tree. Mm. It's a carefully decorated tree. Some of the presents are addressed from Santa to various locals. Do they have Santa here in Monster World? Yo, you're a kid too, right? I can tell because you're wearing a striped shirt. Oh, is that, is that a kid thing? There was more stuff over here. Can I not get... Can I not enter here? I think I figured it out. No, never mind. Out of nowhere, a realistic, a, a disturbingly realistic bunny lady. 
Or can I help you? Okay, let's talk. Say hello. Yeah, and again... And again, the, the music has that, that melody. Apparently all the tracks in this area have this melody, that's very cool. Hey, welcome to Snowden. I can't remember the last time I saw fresh face around here. Where did you come from? Capital? You don't look like a tourist. Are you here by yourself? Yeah, I'm not a tourist. You want to know what to do here in Snowden? Rubis has food and the library has information. If you're tired, you can take a nap at the inn. It's right next door. My sister runs it. I think we don't need to go to the inn because... Uh, we, we're full of HP. And if you're bored, you can sit outside and watch those wacky s s skeletons do their thing. There's two of them. Brothers, I think. They just showed up one day and asserted themselves. Yeah, that sounds like them. The town has gotten a lot more interesting since, since then. Town history. Think back to your history class. A long time ago, monsters lived in the ruins back there in the forest. Long story short, we all decided to leave the ruins and heed and head for the end of the caverns. Along the way, some fuzzy folk decided that they liked the cold and set up camp in Snowden. Oh, and don't think about trying to explore the ruins. Uh, I already did. The door's been locked for ages. Unless you're a ghost or can burrow under the door, forget about it. The door has been locked for ages. Hmm, that's interesting. But we went through that door. Life is the same as usual. A little claustrophobic. But we all know deep down that freedom is coming, don't we? As long as we got that hope, we can grit our teeth and face the same struggles day after day. Oh, the game's getting a little bit... Philosophical. I feel like this game has a lot of that. It it's, looks so quirky and silly, but it, it feels a lot like uh, the kind of JRPG from the 90s that used to get a lot of uh, used to get very existential. Fufuk says, I always thought it was a guy in the shop. Well, it looks to me like it has boobies. Tough glove. Oh man, I, I need defense because I've, I've been getting hit a lot. Heals. 11 HP. I'm gonna buy... Bandana, because I've been getting hit a lot. Uh, I'm gonna get this as well, because I've been getting hit a lot and I need more healing stuff. And I still have a ton of money. I think I'm gonna get another one. Okay, can I sell stuff? Does, does this look like a pawn shop? I don't know how it works where you come from, but... If I start spending money on old branches and used bandages, I'll be out of business in a jiffy. That sounds like a commentary on... JRPG tropes. Yeah, I think that's it. I wonder if I buy even more.
Bye now. I'm again some time. Okay. I don't think we need to go to the inn. Let's just check it out. Hey. Mom says that sleeping can recover your health above your maximum, ex maximum HP? What's maximum HP? So... If I sleep, I get more than 24. Also, let's call Torio. Dialing. Nobody picked up, so she's still mad, huh? Welcome to Snow with Inn. Snow Inn's premier hotel. One night is 80. Do I, how much do I have? No! I spent too much money. I don't have money. Once I get more money, I can come back here, I guess. I can't... can't go. Yeah, I'll have to get more money later and come back here. Wait, talk to these guys. Hey, man. This town doesn't have a mayor. But if there's... Ever a problem, a skeleton will tell a fish lady about it. So the fish lady I know because of the track. Uh, uh, what was it called? I think I I reacted to the to the Undying track, and I know she's the fish lady. I think, I think. Oh, and they talked about it. The Sands and Papyrus talked about. Undyne or Undine, I don't, I don't know. Whoa, look at this place. No matter where I go, it's the same menu, the same people. Help! I want new drinks and hot guys. Listen to the music. Isn't human food different from monster food? It does things like spoil. And when you eat it, it passes all the way through your whole body. Disgusting. I'd love to try it sometime. Can we change the music? It's broken. The capital is getting pretty crowded, so I've heard they're going to start moving here. I don't want to see the erasure of our local culture. I definitely want to see some city slickers slip into slip onto their butts. These are the dogs I met earlier. You you know what this looks like? You guys know that painting uh, of of dogs playing cards? This looks like a reference to that. Think of getting a spiked collar to show off my personality. Makes a statement like Tash, attach a leash to me and take me for a walk, please. Okay. What? We're sentries, but we never get any respect. I wish those skeletons would throw us a bone. We love bones. They're made of bones. You better watch where you sit down in here, kid. Because that big guy will jump into your lap and give you lots of love and attention. Uh, how about you guys? Those dogs are part of the Royal Guard. Oh, so they're, they're the Royal Guard that... Papyrus wants to be a part of. They're, they're all dogs. Papyrus is not a dog. The elite military group led by Undyne. He's rude, loud, and beats up everybody who gets in her way. It's no wonder all the kids want to be like her when they grow up. I 
I put out a line for some girls today. Someone told me that there are plenty of fish in the sea. Well, I'm taking that seriously. I'm literally going to make out with a fish. So this... Was it this guy that put the fishing rod? I wonder if I can go back there. It's playing poker against itself. It appears to be <laughs> losing. <laughs> okay, so everybody is here at the grill base. Everyone is always laughing and cracking jokes. Trying to forget our modern crisis. Dreariness, crowding, lack of sunlight. I would join them, but I'm just not very funny. This game gets very real sometimes. At least I'm not making puns. Like... The, th the thing he said about everybody laughing and trying to be funny to forget the crisis. Too real. We all know the underground has problems, but we smile anyway. Why? We can't do anything, so why be morose about it? Smile, smile. Library. Oh, they said I could get information in the library. It's a school report about monster funerals. Monster funerals, technically speaking, are cool <laughs> as heck. When monsters get old and kick the bucket, they turn into dust. At funerals, we take that dust and spread it on that person's favorite thing. Then their essence will live on in that thing. Uh, am I at the page minimum yet? I'm kind of sick, sick of writing this. That's an interesting commentary on monster funerals. Okay, while monsters are mostly made of magic, human beings are mostly made of water. Humans, with their physical forms, are far stronger than us. Hmm, that's interesting. But they will never know the joy of expressing themselves through magic. You'll never get a bullet pattern birthday card. Here I am writing this book. A person comes in and picks up the book. They start reading it. Oh, sorry, I'm still writing that one. <laughs> because they are made of magic, monsters' bodies are attuned to their soul. If a monster doesn't want to fight, his defenses will weaken. And the crueler the intentions of our enemies, the more their attacks will hurt us. Therefore, if a being with a powerful soul struck with the desire to kill... Uh, let's end the chapter here. Yeah, that makes sense, because the more you kill, the more level you gain. And I don't know much about this level here. But I assume it makes you stronger, right? Okay, not yet. Still mad, still mad. Monster History Part 4 Fearing the humans no longer, we moved out of our old city, home. We braved harsh cold, damp swamp land and searing heat until we reached what we know what we now call our capital. New home. Again, our king is really bad at names. And yeah, I have to I have to equip the the manly bandana. Let, let me see how much defense I have. I have zero defense. That's why I'm dying so easily. Equip the manly bandana. Now I have seven defense. Okay, this will help. Love, hope, compassion. 
this is what people say monster souls are made of, but the absolute nature of soul is unknown. After all, humans have proven their souls don't need these things to exist. <laughs> when I was younger, my teachers gave me word searches when they ran out of assignments. I thought they were a waste of time. But look at me now. I'm the number one word search creator in the entire underground. Good for you. I love working on the newspaper. There's so little to report that we just fill it with comics and games. Must be nice. So these monsters, they're called monsters, but they seem pretty peaceful. That look in your eye. You're someone that has trouble doing crosswords, aren't you? Okay, so you're you're saying that because I, I said crosswords are hard. What about you? Welcome to the library. Yes, we know. The sign is misspelled. What sign? Library. Library. Welcome to the library. box overflowing with unread junk mail okay yes let's look inside papyrus mailbox it's empty so this is sans i suppose he's too lazy to get his mail is this their home it's locked yeah, right? Yona says on, on the chat, my IRL email folder. Me IRL. It's locked from the inside. Okay, so this is the end of the town. Okay, guys. Le let me see what's up here. Oh, there's more town here. Whoa, what are you... What are you doing, man? Let's play monsters and humans. Ah, to be young again, the world sure felt boundless. You aren't gonna make me be the human again, are you? What's up with rocks? Sentient rocks in this game. Ah, what a beautiful knock. Maybe if I don't answer, I'll hear it again. You sure will. Ah, my patient rewards me. This is getting weird. Ah, that knock. Yeah, that's kind of weird. What's this? Okay, so, guys, I'm gonna end the stream here. It's been two hours and two hours and twenty minutes. Two hundred minutes we've been playing. So this 
It was a ton of fun, guys. Let me... Uh... Let me do this. So, guys, thank you very much for hanging out with me. This was a ton of fun. I'm not looking too much at chat in, 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 this, in these streams because people are going crazy. But this was more... And Abigail says that, that was hard work. Again, Abigail, I, I don't know if you were here when I said it, but please don't, don't feel obligated to do anything. If you want to leave, if you think these guys are just being annoying, don't, don't deal with it. Don't, don't feel obligated to do it. Uh, yeah, but I wonder how far into the game I am. I'm, I'm having fun. I haven't been spoiled uh, yet. Except for the, the stuff I inevitably inevitably figure out from the reactions that I do. But other than that, it's been great, guys. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. And now it's time for you guys to say bye in the chat to me. So that I can say bye right back to you. And have a nice weekend for all of you guys. So bye-bye, Jaden. Bye-bye, Abigail. Thank you, Abigail, for helping out. Bye bye Maxor, bye bye Ian, Carol, Angie, Tanner, Guilherme, Triscupa, Corey, Berded Booper, Loras, Jacob, Marco, Antonio, Felipe Mora, Candyman, Signa, Misa, Mikazuki, Trickshot Studio, Red Nodhead, Zabe, Jonathan, Mario, David, Otaku Lord, Piki. Thank you so much, guys. And I'll see you probably. Uh, Next week. Yeah, I hope so. Next week. Bye-bye. Thank you so much.